What's up guys? Today I'm going to talk about the three worst exercises you can possibly do for Jiu Jitsu or, or probably, probably for any sport for that matter. Just there's three things that really stand out to me that are dangerous and uh, sadly I, I'm watching videos again of, of people working out whether it be the pros and also just just some random people doing their BJJ workouts and I've seen all three of these included so <laughs> let's get started here. First, the first one is is box jumps for time and box jumps is just having a surface that's you know that's higher than, than the ground you're standing on and you just jump as many times you can to that surface back down you know back and forth up down up down up down you know box jumps actually are a decent exercise for to increase um, your explosiveness they really are but for time is absolutely horrendous okay this is something where if you're doing box jumps this is something you should you should walk up to the box you know, make sure you're at appropriate distance from the box, concentrate, get set, explode up onto the surface, and then bring yourself back down, nice, slow, and easy, and then, once again, start from the beginning. You know, concentrate, bring yourself, you know, yourself at a nice, nice distance away, back up top, nice and slow. Uh, coming back down to earth rapidly, which going for time encourages you to do, this is a massive strain on your Achilles tendon. You damage your Achilles tendon, man. You're out of jiu-jitsu for a long time. I mean, that year you're going to be referring back to forever. Oh, God, that in 2016 I fucked up my Achilles tendon, was out the whole year, wasted a whole year of training. You know, set me back to whatever. You know, I should have lost a belt. I was so out of it by the time I was able to get back. You know, so don't do it for time, okay? Never, 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 never. So, and kind of in the same vein now, is Olympic or power lifts again for time these are lifts that should be focused on just just each rep should have your complete focus and attention before you do one okay these lifts are amazing they are great as far as for human enhancement uh, can help you in so many of of sports and really help us in jiu-jitsu um, in so many different ways but you, you do anything for time something like deadlifts or oh god is something you can really 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 fuck you back up if you if you do do that for time okay this is something again every repetition you do you should have full concentration on doing that rep properly when you start incenting your incenting yourself to do it for you know, for for a massive amount of time for as many reps as possible that is not going to that's not going to end well guys that is not going to end well okay um, this is kind of a quick story but when I first graduated college, I, I trained with a buddy of mine who was a power lifter, um, and I think I even mentioned this one before. But and you know, I actually we, I learned a lot from from him and stuff. He's just I um, as far as technique and things, and we're both around the same age, I guess 22, 23. And I remember him saying to me, he's like, "Man, I really hope to master my technique by the time I'm 30." And I was like, "30? What? I mean, that's like..." eight, seven, eight years away, you know, it's just like, you insane, you know, but he was serious, I mean, that's how much effort goes into actually mastering these type of techniques, and so, if when you start throwing a variable, like, doing as many as possible, in a minute's time, and two minutes time, whew, that is not encouraging the technique that's required for these exercises, which are normally great, okay, so, not a good idea, so you probably see a theme here, things for time, norm, or a lot of things are, Pretty horrendous, uh, when, especially when you add things like weight. Okay. Last thing I, I've seen, uh, ultimate disaster waiting to happen. <laughs> especially if people just need general core work or anything at the, of weighted exercises on an unstable surface. Okay. And uh, what I mean by this is, say you have a stability ball, one of those large balls that you've probably seen at your gyms and things. Um, and I've seen people do things like stand on those and do barbell squats. Holy shit, man. Okay? Not only is that dangerous to you, I mean, that is potentially dangerous from anyone who's probably within a 20-foot radius. Okay? That is extremely dangerous. Okay? A fall with weight on you is going to do some, something. It's going to, or even the wall of the gym, man. You know, just, if it was my gym, if I saw someone do that, I'd be like, yeah, come here. Where's your, where's your membership card? Shht, shht, you know, goodbye, <laughs> see ya, don't, <laughs> you know, don't do something, this is, that is extremely, extremely, extremely dangerous, you know, I, I think a lot of times people just do is just to show off, 
you know, I, I don't know. Um, I, I don't I don't have necessarily a problem with with I mean something I I guess you know not sound like a hypocrite or anything, but I, I use the times I'll do goblet squats um, on the Bosu ball, but I'm talking really light. I'll grab a dumbbell and I mean I don't go heavier than like 40 pounds and that that's a lot, okay? And on a Bosu ball with the, uh, which is like a half ball, you know, the nice flat surface on top and you know round on on the one end. And but that is like minimal weight because I'm shit. I'm about 220, so. But that is all, guys. That is that is like the max you consider. But when you start throwing in, you know, you know the barbell with plates, oh my god, disaster waiting to happen. Don't 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 do that. I wouldn't even do a bo on a, just a Bosu ball, which is much easier than a stability ball. I would never even do that with you know, just with a barbell. Not even not a chance. Okay. That shit's gonna get people hurt, gonna get, get, get some killed. So stay away from those three exercises, guys. Box jumps for time, Olympic powerlifting lifts for time, and then weighted exercises on unstable surface. All of them, no good, okay? Anyhow, as always, thanks for watching. If you haven't yet, please subscribe to my channel. And if you know anyone else might be interested, you know, watching this channel, I'll send it to them, man, I appreciate that. I, I really enjoy doing this, so thanks for watching. We'll talk to you soon. Oh.